guys welcome back to my channel if you're new here then welcome 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 my name is Mariana and I'm so happy to meet you so today guys I'm giving you guys a review of the Koji San skin lightening kojic acid soap so before we get into anything let's not forget to give this video a thumbs up leave a comment or question in the comment section down below don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you haven't done so already and be sure to click that notification bell so that you don't miss another upload from me so guys so many of you have been asking me for more makeup videos i am no makeup guru by no means i do not spend like a whole bunch of money on makeup or anything like that it's not a huge love of mine but since you guys are asking for it i decided to do a fall makeup look for you guys so if you'd like to see how i created this makeup look then be sure to check out my next video that's coming next wednesday all right it's a fall makeup look without further ado let's get into the video she's a mona lisa Everyone's lining up to see her She's a Mona Lisa Everyone's lining up to see her There must be something that feeds her You'll find her So let's talk about this Kojic Acid Soap Alright, I paid $49.95 for it at Price Mart You can also find it on Amazon for my international friends so this is the packaging real cute let me tell you what the box says so the kojic acid you've always trusted the one prescribed by a dermatologist is now available in koji san skin lightening soap koji san contains high grade cosmetic all natural kojic acid that helps prevent melanin production, making skin lighter and clearer. Koji San Skin Lightening Soap is effective in diminishing dark spots, freckles, and acne, stretch marks, and uneven skin tone. So, that is exactly what I need to deal with acne, the dark spots, um, uneven skin tone. You guys know the drill with me by now, right? Um, so when you take it out of the box, it's packaged in this clear, I don't know what material you call this, hard plastic I would say probably, um, Koji, and it has the, it's logo written all over Koji Sun Skin Lightening Soap. There's a logo also, the logo is also engraved on the soap right here. As you can see, it's a bright orange. Well, it's an orange soap, right? So I bought two of these. So let me, this one is still in the packaging. The other one, what I did, I cut, I cut it in three, three pieces to make it easier to work with. Not really easier to work with, but to preserve the life of the soap. So I just cut it into three pieces since I'll, I'm not using it as much. I, I'll just show you. So I have it in a soap dish here. And in the dish you'll see right here, I just have it. This is like a third of the soap right here. And um, that way it preserves the life of the soap, making it last longer. Um, so yeah, that's it here, right? Um, pertaining to the smell, it's it has a really strong scent. It's it smells like acid. <laughs> it smells like perfumed acid. That's the best way I could describe it to you guys. Like perfume and acid mixed together. That's the best way I could say it. It's not a terrible scent, but that's the way it smells, right? So people who are um, sensitive to smell, this is not something for you. Pertaining to how it worked for me, I would say that 
um, I have seen a difference in my skin and I will insert before and after photos. It definitely helps to clear up my acne. It's a real gentle exfoliator and I can see that it has lightened my scars a bit and it has gotten rid of my acne. Well, I want to say help because I was, at first I started using this on its own for, for I used it on its own for probably like about a week or two. And then I started incorporating other products because I found that this was moving, it was working a tad bit too slow for my liking. So um, I was using it every day in the first week, but then it started to like, it dried out my hands so much that like my hands started peeling. So then I started using my, uh, let me get it. All right, I'm back. So then I started using my Vanity Planet um, skin cleansing brush. This I use, it comes with three heads, but I only use, uh, for this exfoliator, I've only been using this silicone type head. That way it stopped exfoliating like my hands and having my hands looking all dry and crusty and peely on the, you know. One of my amazing friends in the comments section, you guys are truly amazing, you know, I really love you guys. One of you commented that I shouldn't use this soap every day because it will bleach my skin. I stopped using it every day and then I started using it only twice per week. I would say this is my most important finding. This soap works better. Not better. It works best when it's also paired with another supporting acid. So it, on its own, it's not enough in my opinion. You guys know I have acne, so I use salicylic acid sometimes on my face, but what I found is that when I use this Koji San soap with glycolic acid, that changed the game. It literally changed the game. I used um, this glycolic cleansing gel. Let me get it for you guys. So this is a small sample size that I have from MAD Skincare. Um, and this is it right here. Let me just tell you guys, when I paired these two together, that was it. It started working. Like I actually saw something happening real quickly too. So just to recap, it's a real gentle exfoliator. It worked really quickly on my skin when I paired it with the glycolic acid. Um, don't use it too often. You can use it like twice a week and it gives you a real gentle exfoliation. I don't know how many times I would say gentle exfoliation in this video. Gentle exfoliation again. Okay, cool. And if you're using it and you don't have a spin brush, use a spin brush. If you don't have a spin brush, use gloves when you're cleansing your skin with it. it your hand, your hands won't look pretty. All right, so that's it. Also, what I also found is that you have to use the soap for 30 seconds to a minute. Well, in any case, when you're cleansing your skin, you're supposed to use the one minute rule. I don't know if you guys know about the one minute rule, but the one minute rule is that every, every time you're cleansing your skin, you um, massage the cleanser into your skin for one minute. With this soap, I started off with 30 seconds and then I gradually extended the time to one minute. So I did 30 seconds, then 45 seconds, and then one minute. And then I stuck to one minute because my skin is used to it now. Also, it did make my skin peel a bit, but that could have been the glycolic acid doing that. More than likely it was the glycolic acid doing that. So that's my findings, you guys. Okay, so now for how I use the Koji San Kojic Acid Skin Lightening Soap. So I take the soap and I apply, I rub it all over my already wet 
face massages into my skin for, as I told you guys, one minute. I started off at first with only 30 seconds, and then I grew to 45 seconds, and then and now I use it for one minute. The one minute rule is everything, you guys. It really helps to get all the impurities out of your skin when you massage your skin with a cleanser for one minute. Thank you so much for watching this video all the way to the end i really and truly appreciate it if you have enjoyed the video please give this video a thumbs up or even if it was helpful to you give this video a thumbs up leave a comment or a question in the comment section down below and be sure to subscribe to my channel if you haven't done so already don't forget in my next video you'll be seeing this makeup look and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye. Mwah.